Yeah. Got a show for y'all. Got a damn good show. James Franco. That's a big time movie star. Yeah, big time actor. I, I was wondering what happened to him because I don't see him anymore. Women brought him down. Yeah. Yeah, women. Women her, brought down another good man. Well, apparently he did some inappropriate things. I did inappropriate things. You don't see me counsel, do you? <laughs> what man hasn't did anything inappropriate? What what woman hasn't did anything inappropriate? Well, these days you flirt with somebody and they wasn't open to it. Mm-hmm. It's called sex harassment. So if I flirt with you, hey, you want to, you want to, hey, hey, you, 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 if I flirt with a woman and she, All right, that's better. Yeah, if I flirt with a woman, that could be considered sexual harassment. Yeah, but me and you flirt a different way. I, I go say, my way of flirting, I'm saying, hey, how's it going? Oh, wow, you, man, your hair is gorgeous. Name's Keith, by the way. Yeah, yeah I want to get sucked off. <laughs> that's sexual harassment. <laughs> that's... <laughs> But by but I'm flirting. I'm Ain't nobody casual. gonna be. Flirting. I was joking, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, you so cute, man. I've I've never did this before. Um, can you jerk me off? <laughs> you gotta make it like. I don't know what came over me. <laughs> I just want you to jerk me off. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, let's get back to James Franco, man. James Franco, man. Well, this video... He's uh, a very talented actor, man. man very talented, yeah. right? Um, so this video is going around on... I think it's TikTok. Let's go to the video. Yeah. <sighs> Look, I'll admit, I did sleep with students. I didn't sleep with anybody in that particular class. Over the course of my teaching, I did sleep with students, and that was wrong. Yeah, so but I, he, had, he had an acting class, something like that. If I'm you, James, I'm a big time actor. People see me as a, uh, as a sex symbol. I'm not gonna put myself in that position. Why'd you even put yourself in that position? Man, you you know you gonna sleep with him. Hey, you know you gonna get sucked off. You know you gonna have anal. What are you talking? You about? You know you gonna be giving facials. You know you doing all that. You know both them ankles going behind them ears. Yeah. And Franco's just gonna leave the nuts hanging out. I wouldn't put myself in that position. I mean, you James Franco. That's like a crackhead going into a, uh, a recovering crackhead. Ain't smoke crack. Going into like, a trap house. And going into a crack house. As soon as you see somebody sucking that damn glass pipe, you be like, man, I want to get, I want to suck on too. As <laughs> soon as you see the markers, oh, I want to suck them too. <laughs> but that's a crime. I know if you teach it for the public school system, yeah. you're teaching it to university. And they're underage, yeah. Yeah. If you're yeah. underage, it's a crime. Oh, but, no, no, no. You necessarily got to be underage. You could be 18. You could be a legal age of that state. Yeah. It's still a crime. But he's teaching high an school. acting class. High school. This is, no, this, he's got his own school going. A high school? Something like that. Let he's me go. teaching high school? Let I me. thought he had an acting class. Hey, you need to calm down. No, that's that, that's no, fair game down. right there. You come to my class, you want to get some tip, I'm going to give it to you. <laughs> I'm gonna yeah, gi I'm gonna give you the mushroom tip, and I'm gonna give you the mushroom tip sauce. Hey, and tell you what, you do a good job. I'm gonna, I got some contacts in Hollywood. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have you in the background making big money. Hey, you so, gonna be picking up trash though, but you gonna make some good money. Yeah. So let me read the article. That was a joke. You didn't get it, did you? What? I was gonna hire as an extra, but you can get paid really good. You know what? That's man. You being some male chauvinist right now. You don't supposed to talk like this. Everybody know I'm joking though. Yeah, I know that. It's just jokes. This, 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 Male humor. It's not funny. So I think it's funny. I actually think it's pretty hey, Kel, damn funny. Hey, I think it's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, my stomach's hurting. I'm laughing so hard. Hey, man, get serious on this. So he was me, teaching high school with biology or something? Hey, Kel, chemistry? Hey, can I get to the damn article so I can tell you what's going Excuse on? Excuse me, sir. Just asking questions over here. You ain't like I feel uh, like I'm getting interrogated over here. Oh, I'm you just, a damn cop? <laughs> I'm just asking questions. All right, let me read the article. We're going to read it then. You need to calm down. Let's go to the article. All right, in 2014. I bet he did all them. <laughs> man, yeah, look, man, I'd have had him up in the line. <laughs> y'all know who I am. I'm James Franco. Yeah, yeah every, I, I'm each one of y'all getting 15 minutes. All right, let me the read. last one is going to be uh, Selena Gomez. You're getting five. <laughs> I'm not going to last too long. <laughs> I've been doing all this stroking. My tip is over here fizzing. Hey, Kevin. Um, 
I'm gonna be got real. all this alka seltzer leaking out my. T- <laughs> I got all that damn fizz action going. You know, you get ready to um, you ready to have orgasm at tip start fizzing. <laughs> <laughs> Head start swelling them nuts. <laughs> Did nuts get tight? <laughs> hey, kid, let me read the article, man. Hey, kid, let me read, man. Well, read it, there, man. Ain't well, nobody holding. Gotta, ain't nobody keep me from reading the damn article, man. Well, you gotta shut up. We're gonna read it. Read the damn article. 2014 was the first time that an allegation of sexual impropriety was leveled against him. One he had, one he had later admitted was true. The incident began when a then 17 year old girl. Where you at, man? I can't even see where you going. See, this is what I'm talking about when I'm reading shit. You start to talk? talking to me like we having a conversation. I'm reading. I'm trying to follow along. Where you reading? Just you just, in the first paragraph or second? Act like you in kindergarten. I'm reading your damn story. That's what you did. No, I would have followed along, man. man. Which, where you at? The first, second, third? Where, hey, where you shut at? Shut up. The incident began. Where you at, nigga? I'm trying to figure out where you at. I'm about to walk out of what here. What paragraph? Since the It's the first paragraph. Okay, then. That's all I'm asking. The damn second sentence. The incident began? Yeah, the incident began when a then 17-year-old girl posted screenshots of chats. I met my wife when she was 17, too. I didn't give a damn. Can't catch me. Statue of limitations. It timed and ran out. <laughs> <laughs> they got Frank on How old are you, 17? I don't give a damn. <laughs> That's legal in uh well yeah. it's not legal in that other state. It's legal here. It's legal where you met her though, Kevin. Won't you shut up? No, it ain't. Not in that state. Kevin, stop playing. I man. go to jail for <laughs> Do some hard time. Look, the instant- Be a sex offender. I had to check in every two weeks. Put a, a boot around my leg. Hey, you you getting close to the school. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was I shouldn't have joked about it. That's, that's not funny. Hey, can let me read, man. Yeah, I take that back. Matter of fact. Probably delete that. I'm going to take this microphone. I'm going to bash across your damn skull. The incident began when a then 17-year-old girl posted screenshots of chats between herself and Franco in which he tried to get her to come to his hotel room. Since the age of 17 is the... Look, since the age of consent in New York was 17, his actions weren't illegal, but it still brought on a firestorm of criticism against him. Four years later, at the height of the Me Too movement, he was hit with further allegations. Ironically, he stood in solidarity with victims by wearing a Times hey, Up pin to the 2018 can, Golden Globes the same I, year. Can I interrupt you? Can I, yeah, won't you wait till I get to an end of a sentence? Yeah, this is the OJ syndrome. OJ syndrome? Yeah. The hell you talking OJ about? got off that, that crime, right? Right. So the next time they threw the book at him. You see what I'm saying? But some teams They think like, he got away. They don't think that was more the right what he did, so they started digging. And I'm pretty sure, I don't know, I'm just speculating that these allegations might be fabricated. Some team They might be concocted to, 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 uh, to ruin his career. Yeah, 17 is legal, though. Yeah, but that he, doesn't, like, I'm, I'm like, well, I'm, a, I'm up there. And I did a 17-year-old, can't touch me. I wanted it, she wanted it. But you see what I'm saying, right? What? He treat James Franco like a nigga, a murdering nigga. <laughs> and what happened to white privilege? Huh? <laughs> and let me read. They treat that man like he murdered somebody. All he did was get his tip wet. They treated Jeffrey Dahmer better. Look. Oh, he didn't even get his tip wet. They didn't even have sex. No, nah, she wouldn't come to the room. Who well, was the crime? The 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 ages leave. Nothing happened. Where's the crime? Hey, how how long are you gonna kick this dead horse? Why y'all punishing that white man? Where's the crime? Nothing happened. I bet she was bad as hell, too. Yeah, because some of these girls don't look like I bet she at 17 said, man, let me hit her up. See if she'll come to the room. I'm trying to get sucked off. Hey. I remember I was talking to this one girl. I had no idea what day she was. I said, bitch, you crazy. They give me 30 years for this shit. (laughs) Oh, yeah, we'll sit on. No, don't you give him too much information. We, See what they did to James Franco, right? Who is talking to this what girl? What do you think right? they're going to do to our black ass? <laughs> I threw to... that girl out. I said, get the hell <laughs> around me. The hell's wrong with you? We didn't know how, we didn't realize how old she was till her daddy pulled up. <laughs> that girl was developed, boy. <laughs> that girl had soccer practice. <laughs> I said, man, I, if I, if well, I could, I was, what? We was in our um, 20s when that happened. We was way younger than that. 
Yeah, you talking long, about? That's a long time ago. Let me keep reading. He was way younger than that. Let me keep reading. 20s. The irony was that the Los Angeles Times later reported that a further five women had now accused him of serious, sexually inappropriate, and sexually exploitative behavior. Hey, you talking like that for? He put all them big words and I had to slow down. Yeah. The allegations revolved around Franco's time as their mentor and acting teacher at his now defunct filmmaking and acting school studio for You open up an acting school with a bunch of hot girls coming in there. All them going, I'm going to give all them extra credit. And you famous and all them giving you the eyes like, yeah, you can get it. That's like Denzel Washington open up a school for black young females. He's complicit in his own demise. <laughs> Hey, let me keep reading, man. You crazy as hell, white man. <laughs> look at him. He looking like a convict in that picture. Hey, hey look. Uh, look at his face. Oh, you going to give it to me. <laughs> look, the most disturbing allegation stated that Franco, Franco regularly alluded to th there being possible roles available to female students if they were to perform sexual acts or were willing to remove their clothing. That's always been that way. Some women not into He it. just said it out loud. Yeah. Worse, worse were allegations that he would remove vaginal guards from female students. Vaginal uh, guards? Yeah, vaginal guards from What's a vaginal guard? Shut up and let me fucking read the fucking article. What's a vaginal guard? What did you think is guarding a vaginal? How did you know? It's, it, are there penis guards out there? What the hell's a vaginal guard? It, it, if you would have waited 10 seconds, you would have figured it out. Okay. I'm gonna go and let you finish. Maybe I'll be able to figure it out on my own. Go on and finish. Worse were allegations that he will remove vaginal guards from female students while teaching sex scene classes. And, and oh, I get it. And simulated things like make oral, sure nothing goes inside, huh? Yeah, and simulated things like oral sex on them without the guards in place. So I guess when you're enacting, they put guards over it. Mm -hmm. They said, "Nah, we don't need that, baby." No, I'm sorry, my tip touched it. I don't. Get, give me that guard. Give it out of here. Yeah. I'm kidding. But he didn't admit to that. He just said he had sex with some students that wasn't. That was the allegation, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I wasn't there, so. I knew I know women lie. I know men lie, too, but women really lie. When women lie, they do big lies. Oh, I'm pregnant. I'm like, what? We haven't had sex yet. Yeah, I mean, you... Did um, you get that? That joke just went right over your head. I was thinking, what you say? What you say? Won't you pay attention to what I'm saying? Say it again. I said when women lie, they lie. Their lies are big. Like, oh, I'm, oh, you're pregnant? Wait a minute. You, we haven't had sex yet. <laughs> you know women? You know what I mean? Women lie to me? Oh, I'm pregnant. I was like, how far along are you? I'm about three months. What? I just met you two weeks ago. <laughs> you know, women lie all the time. Yeah. I was going to say something like you... you Totally blew it. Wrong. Must have been in, must have not been important. You forget it that easy. Now I know what guards is. I wonder if they got a guard to keep your penis from getting hard. Like put a clamp on it or something. No man, you doing those? Sex I'm gonna scenes. need one of them penis clamps because I'm, I'm gonna get a full erection. <laughs> I'm doing, clamp. I'm doing a sex scene. <laughs> I need a clamp. Oh man, you touching my buttons? <laughs> <laughs> No, nah, I ain't gonna do hey, that. Hey, cut that camera off. Oh, I'm a slim. <laughs> hey, Kim, what's wrong with you? I was just joking. I'm just joking. Numb and gel? Numb and gel. Producer said they use numb and gel. <laughs> you looking good. You pushing them buttons. Put some gel on it, huh? Put some gel on it, huh? Numb it out. Put some, what's that stuff they put on your tooth when it's hurting? Novocaine. Put some Novocaine on your tip. Put the Novocaine right down on the tip. Right, right there around the head. <laughs> Put it on the head and the balls. You ain't going to feel nothing. <laughs> Put some Novocaine. Look, he put some Novocaine on my nipples. <laughs> put some Novocaine on my neck. Get the head real good and spray the rest on my balls. <laughs> <laughs> they, they, they call it tip killer. <laughs> hey, what's the tip killer? My nut, my nuts is getting tight over. <laughs> Just looking at them. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Some of these um, actresses, man, you getting a hot scene, man. Yeah, I don't know, man. It's just, you, you got to be careful around, around women, man. It'll ruin your whole career.
Yeah, something happened. That, that was old. That you was, can't even verify if it's true or not. You they can just, just allegations. They just make the allegation. Yeah, and your career is over, and people just can't see for that. Yeah. Great talent, though. You'll be back. You'll be back, huh? Just stay away from you know teaching students and stuff. Yeah, don't let put this your, shit blow over. Yeah, like being a crackhead. Don't go back in the crack house. Don't hang around crackheads. Yeah, it blow over. You'll be back, man. You'll be back. But then he gonna get back to acting. Them fans gonna come back. Oh, James Franco. You be like, oh, he's coming back. <laughs> hey, what you doing, man? <laughs> that sexual deviancy gonna come back out. <laughs> that ain't deviance. That's just being a man. <laughs> That was a damn good show. Damn good show. Hey, we got a new giveaway going. We're giving away a full wrap. You go to officialhorsetwins.com. Anything you buy, automatically enters you to win. Yeah, don't forget about $10,000 in cash. And when man. you win, you get $10,000 in cash, too. Yeah, so you can pay your taxes on that truck. Still have some money left off. Take the girl, your boyfriend, or whatever you're into. You go out, go out, have a night on the town. Celebrate your new truck. Yeah.